What up, gamers? Dead Guy here, and welcome back to the channel. We're at another episode of Surround Dead with Victoria Thorne here, and I believe this is episode 7 or 6, I can't really remember. But, in the last episode, we kind of went out and, you know, tried to find some stuff. And, if you look over here, we found this little orbiter ornament. Put that down here. Uh, found this little dog ornament. Let's see if I can't go in first person. Oh, that's not how you do it. I think it's T. Yeah, T. Here we go. Yeah, look at the little guy. <laughs> Sick. Well, hey, welcome back to the channel, everybody. I put this dresser down as well. I got filled that up with my Mosin. Because I'm going to be rocking the Benelli and the uh, Winchester here. And welcome back, welcome back. In this episode, I'm thinking about doing this, guys. I'm thinking about heading to this crashed ship save zone. Just to see what that's all about. Maybe they have a filter I could buy. And if not, we're going to head over to Whitewood here. Just kind of explore this area because I haven't been this side of the map yet. And to be honest, there's probably not a whole lot over here either. This kind of actually looks like something interesting. But yeah, we're going to go exploring over here and then possibly the valley save zone and then maybe farther north of the map. Um, and I need, I'm looking for a filter this episode, so if I don't find a filter, then, uh, yeah. I don't know what we're gonna do. We gotta look for a filter. So, that's the goal, the filter. And, yeah, so let's get out there, and let's get to it, alright? Alright, guys, it looks like we're gonna have to get across this river. And I am not too sure how we'll do that because the bridge <laughs> is a little busted up. Just a little. So to be honest, I'm not entirely sure how we can do that. Oh shit. Not good, not good, not good, not good. Oh, and there's more people right there. Oh, shit, guys. That wasn't good. Looks like there's a bunch of bandits by the bridge. Yeah, we got some bandits hanging out by the bridge. Let me check the map. Okay, so it seems I actually went the wrong way. I want to head here. Gonna follow this road. Interesting. So. That's the only way across the river. So, you so there's really no reason to even go to the bridge. Uh, there might be loot over there. I don't know. Maybe we'll come back. Wait. No way. Yes. Guys. After some driving, look what I found. Good old shakes. I guarantee you this guy has a, a filter that we need. I was completely wrong. The GPS had 556 five, rounds. That's actually disappointing. But you know what? I have a lot of stuff I could sell. Alright, cool guys. I just sold a bunch of stuff. Got myself some more room in the in the truck here. So we're gonna go back out. We're gonna go to that other area I was talking about. We're gonna keep the journey going. Now, this seems to be the bridge, and there's nothing really to it, so let's go right past that. Alright, so this looks to be the area that we have to go, and of course there's a bunch of bandits over here. So I'm going to go up and over this mountain, or this hill right here. Let's go up and over. We don't want to fight the bandits as much as possible, just because I don't have a repair kit. At least I don't think in the van. Or the truck. But we are officially on the other side of the map. Cool. So, yep, we gotta go southwest, guys. So, let's head over there and see what we can't find. There seems to be a really tall building right here. This looks cool. Fire truck. I've actually never been out this way, so this is going to be interesting. Alright, guys. So it seems this is Whitewood right now. 
Let's let's take let's take Whitewood over, huh? Let's cause a little ruckus. Yeah, if I can even shoot. Shit. Let's take this one out with our kukri. Nice. All right, I'm just going to loot these bodies, and then we'll continue on. Ooh, an M9. Look at that. We got something we got to sell already. Let's go. I'm going to loot these bodies, and we'll cut this out. All right, guys. I found two M9s on those zombies, which is actually nuts. But we're just going to continue on here. Gonna search some stuff, and we're gonna see what we can't find in the town of Whitewood. I'm just gonna consume that. Need to get my stuff up here. Oh, nice, guys. I just found a battery. Which I can put onto here, see? Right? No? Or maybe I have to unequip them? That don't seem right. Hold on. How do you do this now? Okay. Um. I don't know how to do that. It looks like I could drop it into my flashlight. No? Okay. What is going on? Uh, incredibly weird. It won't let me equip that yet. Shit. Here they come. Ooh, fitness. Let's read that. Oh, shit. Too many of them. No. Oh, nope. It's a battle. Nice. Take your money. Definitely an aseptic. More money, more cloth always. Let's go. We're still rocking 81% health, so we should be good. Can I check these ambulance? No. Dang, the town of Whitewood looks insane. Oh, shit. <laughs> Crazy guy just came out of nowhere, little bastard. What is this? Okay. This is just an empty building. Nice. Medical supplies. We need that. 100%. Oh, come on. Nothing in there. Ooh, antibiotics? Treats radiation. First time seeing that. Oh, an auto injector and antiseptic? Paramedic pants. I'm going to sell those just because I've never actually seen those. That's kind of cool. Look at that out there, guys. <laughs> That's interesting. All right, we got some nails. Always good. Cloth, some wood. Uh, I really don't need wood. It takes up too much space, and I can, I can farm that no problem when I'm back at base. Looks like this keeps going up, too, which is nice. If I can keep finding some medical supplies, that, that would be great. So I'm guessing that medical supplies spawn in medical places, which is nice. That's that's really nice. Some games, like, the supplies are just random, but it's good to know that you can go somewhere and then you get exactly what should be there. Yes, guys, we found a filter. Look at that. Look at that. I'm so glad we stopped. Uh, first aid made easy. Increase your ability in first aid. Um, yeah, I'll do that. I still don't really understand what stuff like that does yet. Um, it is so weird that there's no stuff in there. 
But yeah, I don't understand what uh, those skills do yet. Because I haven't really seen an improvement. Maybe I just don't know it. Come on, there's going to be something in here. Yes, guys, we're making out huge with all this medical stuff. So we have to remember, white wood is good for medical supplies. Very good for medical supplies. We want to make as many rags and bandages as we can now. So we've got some antiseptic. We got med kits. And I love that anytime you come into a building, expect no zombies. Little to none. That's always good. That's how you know you can just kind of loot and scoot. Lots of bandages, guys. I'm real happy about that. Looks like we got a few more floors, too. I'm going to drink some water, though, because my thirst is getting pretty low. Can't stack these med kits. There's water right here. Uh, I'm just going to... Drop that. You can fill, which is nice. But yeah, guys, I'm actually really enjoying this series. Thank you guys so much for uh, coming along on the journey. And if you haven't already, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It helps you out. It helps me out. Um, and I just let you guys know, I'm I'm always looking for comments, and I'll always respond to comments. Interact with me in the comments, guys. I love talking to you guys. I, I want to hear your opinion of the game, of the series itself. How are you feeling about Victoria Thorne? Because I'm feeling pretty good. This is the farthest I've ever gotten in Surround Dead, for one, which is insane. I do like this game a lot, and it looks like we just got another first aid made easy. So, that's huge. And it said one skill point, but I really, I still don't get what that does. All right, so nothing on the roof. Okay, guys, we got a whole town to search. Look at this. It looks like there's something in the back over there, but yeah, we've got a whole freaking town. So let's get back down there, eh? All right, we don't want to make too much noise now because it's probably a lot of zombies. Let's get the kookery out. I didn't think uh, we would need it, but we're actually needing uh, more water and, f and food. More water than anything. There we go. Um, You know, I could take some alcohol always. I'll take a lamp, actually, because that's, that's actually pretty funny. I can always use a little light back at base. Alright, we're finding a lot of pistol stuff now, which is good. Money's always good. I can't wait to get to that save zone and see what kind of stuff they offer. Got a little ammo crate there, which is good. I definitely need to find more ammo. More batteries, very nice, very nice. Vehicle repair kit's huge, guys. I need that. Looks like it's getting nighttime, too, and for some... Ooh, nice. I need all that. Um... Yeah, for some reason, it won't let me put the battery... Oh, man, there's a lot of freaking zombies over here. Let's... All right, let's make it quiet for right now. I could just, go... could just go loud and take them all out, to be honest, but I might have to use a lot more ammo. And the whole point is me saving ammo, so I could go do this... Oh, shit. If they trickle in... Like this, it shouldn't be no, any problem. But yeah, the whole point of me not shooting them right now is so I can save my ammo, be a little more conservative, so I can go do the, um, um, what's it called? Like an FOB or something, because that's where all the good loot is. That's like really good stuff. Oh, it noticed me. Huh, bunk bed. Would look cool in the bunker. Alright. I'm gonna try... Put the battery in here again. Oh, okay. Let me try to put the battery in here. No. 
Can I put the filter? No. I don't understand that. I'm not quite understanding why I can't put that in the slots. Nice. Got some supplies here, which is always good. Take that. Another wall light, bullet casing. I feel like I heard something coming here. Ooh. Okay. Increase our ability and toughness. Yes. We're going to drink that. Uh, what is this? Incre Once red gives a times three multiplier to, spe to a specific passive skill to level up. Okay. That's pretty tight. Uh, Newton's Cradle. Let's take that. That seems pretty, pretty wicked. Yeah, we got we got a lot of medical supplies, which is really good for us guys. We want medical supplies, so we could definitely take on those that harder content. The problem here, though, is I have batteries, but for some reason, I can't use them. I'm going to use these chem lights for now. Uh, bandage is good. I'm definitely going to take a lamp because I still don't even understand the electricity in this game. Oh, it looks to be some tents. Those tents usually have really good equipment in there. Alright, so I'm going to toss a chem light. You know, that doesn't really do much. Oh, shit. Come on. It's all good. We got plenty of bandages. There we go. Look at that. He had a lamp on him. Some baked beans. Let's get our food all the way up here. Alright, so what I'm going to do here... I'm going to toss a Kimlet. Just so I can see. We're going to search these containers. Got ammo. I'm going to have to bolt cut that one. If it lets me. We got to be careful though. We don't want a quick break. It will alert all those zombies in the area. Oh my lord. Um... Normal binoculars, I am going to sell those. Put that there. We'll take these military ones. An ammo container is... Actually good. Like, I, I can keep that on me now that I think about it. Um, and I can just put all my ammo in there. So, I'll move that real quick. Uh, a Remington 700, I will take that, an AKM, drum mag, hell yeah guys, that is what I'm talking about, that Remington right there, ooh, that's looking spicy, I am liking this town so far, this is as, oh, shit, we got a straggler coming in, we can take these guys out one at a time, no problem. Take all these lamps. I really, I, I need stuff like that to light up that freaking bunker. We have one, two, two zombies. That's it. Oh, there's a crawler over there. I really want like. Oh, nice! A third freaking M9. I really want like another. There's got to be a better um, melee weapon. There's got to be. I think I took out all the zombies, to be honest. There might be one or two. Yep. I know there's a crawler over there. But, you know. I ain't totally worried about a crawler. Let me throw this chem light down. Okay, there's a zombie coming in through the garage. Yep. 
Oh shit. Nice. I can't see anything, guys. I'm gonna have to bump it up for you as well. Perfect. Take that. I'm gonna have to bump it up for you guys as well, because the YouTube compression's a bitch. Ooh, storage crates. Absolutely take that. Um toolbox, I could sell it. Yeah, we'll, we'll sell that. Ooh, nice. Uh, I definitely want to take scrap. Concrete wall, I can take. I'll take a wood plank. I'll take that stuff. It can be useful, you know. It's nice to just build out the, uh, the base, you know, get it all bulked out and looking nasty. Ooh. Winchester. Good, I'll sell. Man, this town is really good. I highly recommend going to this town. I hear zombies to my left over here. It looks like the chem lights never go away. No, I can't push these little crawler guys. Oh, he's, he's toughened. Whatever that means. Alright, let's try one more time to get a freaking battery in this thing. No. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why I can't... Why I can't use batteries and filters right now. I'm gonna have to look that up. That, to me, seems like a bug. Alright, there's just a lot of zombies over here. I don't think I looted that building, so I'm gonna go there. Oh. Yep, let's say I see a few straggler zombies. Did I go in that house either? Oh, I think I did. Let's eat that. I think I did. Comes another zombie. The more we eat, the more our water goes down. And that's the one thing I'm worried about is water. I actually have to take um, radiation pills as well as from what it looks like. So let me take some of that. I really want to do like harder content. Um really want to hit those, like, FOBs. Those military bases are where all the good loot is. Another ammo crate. I'm good with one right now. Is there nothing over here? So they added this like deeper water recently. This never used to be a thing. So it's pretty cool. All right, we're gonna take out all these zombies. Nice, daytime. Beautiful. We're gonna just uh, save our ammo. Chop these guys to bits. Should have brought my 9 mil, but I was lacking on ammo, and I want to save all of that ammo for sure for uh, one of the FOBs or harder content. So I can't see anything right now, guys. This rain does not help. I see, like, something glowing over there? I just don't know what the heck that is. We're gonna check all these cabinets and stuff, though. All these shop counters and whatnot. Uh, I will drink that, but where does it go after I drink it? Because I don't want to hold on to that. I don't know. 
Yeah, this place has been absolutely worthwhile. Anyway, I can start uh, bringing some water back. Because we are filled up on water. Milk. Oh yeah, all the good stuff. This town has been worth it, and I should have came here a long time ago. I'm getting filled up, so I might have to go back to the, the car, and the car is just down over there. But I really want to check out all this stuff. I got some glowing eyes over there. It looks like another zombie. Yep, come on, buddy. I got one more building to check in the... Uh, Whitewood, is it? I believe it's Whitewood, yeah. Then you check this building. It's just really dark right now. I'm getting some XP for killing zombies. I guarantee you there's something good in that building. Like, what is that? Oh, is that a campfire for bandits? Okay. Yeah, we're not going to mess with that. Yeah, I wonder if I could find a better melee weapon. That would be really nice. This is a pretty cool place. From what I can see. Uh, definitely gonna sell those. Another lunchbox, no. I like tents, they do hold a lot, but I'm actually kind of slowly weaning out my tent at the moment. I don't want to, like, my whole base filled with tents kind of just want to find some storage boxes, some storage crates, some more dressers. Load it up that way. I'm not seeing anything. Cool. Um, it looks like a multiple story building, but I am not seeing any stairs unless this is it. Yeah, this looks like it's it. Okay, yep. Oh, look at this, guys. Breaking a locker? Yes, please. It's usually where the good shit is. Give me the good shit. Is that another one right there? That is. Okay. I might not have room for all of this. Military backpack. Eh. Makeshift drum mag. I'll, I'll take a vertical grip. Tactical helmet. Protection 6. Protection 10. Uh, the makeshift drum mag... For sure. See, I'm going to get rid of this concrete wall. Like, those don't really do anything for me. It's mainly for aesthetic of the base, and I do like my base aesthetics, but this is much more important. Military container. Interesting. Uh, what is that? What is that used for, though? Is it better, like, than an ammo container? I guess I could just put stuff in it. Yeah, I could just put some stuff in it. Free up some space. Containers within containers, man. It's like Tarkov with this game. Ooh. Nice. That's huge. Not that we absolutely need it, but definitely like to have more guns. What is this? Oh, the sneaking? Okay. Oh, no effect. I guess I'm already... I'll, I'll keep it with me. I'll keep it with me. Let's move this here. Yeah, this is the Lego stuff, man. This is, you got to figure out where things go and what you're going to put there. And There we go. More guns are always better. And if we don't want it, we can just sell it. See? More guns, man. It's insane. Way too many guns. Uh, I might start grabbing some of these things just to sell. Gotta get that money up any which way possible. I'll get rid of stuff if I find anything else cooler. Oh. Trash bag, okay. Um, a water jug. Could use that, I could use that, but I have so much <laughs> I have so much stuff, man. I might just I'm just gonna drink it. Um I do would like to sell that stuff, but no room. 
All right, so we're going to have to just... We're going to have to go back to the car. Because I believe I checked out all of this area as well, and there really wasn't anything. I don't want to fight those bandits without my uh, vehicle. So I'm going to go back to the car. Do a drop-off, do some organizing and stuff. So we're back. Um... I disorganized and put my stuff away. So we're in Whitewood, right? This is a great location. I gotta come back here. It does look like there seems to be something off to the right there, which I feel like I should check out since I'm here. And then after that... I'm gonna head to... I think it's this way. Right? No. Yeah, see, there is a second story to this building. I just don't know how to get there. Here, actually, let me let me just see if there's a staircase I missed or something. Wow, there is. Right in my face. It, it, the dark is really dark in here. Okay. I'm glad I stopped because, wow, I am really liking what I'm seeing right now. Let's hope there's some really good loot in here. And, yeah. Yeah. Very much so. A holographic site. Can I... That's a pistol compensator. Can't add anything to that. Uh, military NVGs, another M9, another AKM, a P90, pistol compensator. I would like to take that coyote backpack, but, you know, whatever. Hopefully there's some ammo in here. Need ammo. We need lots of ammo. Ooh, 50 BMG rounds. That's nice. 5.56 five, and 7.62 is always worthwhile. Hello. Let's... Ah. Uh, Lockpick plus. I, I don't know how I was able to lockpick locks before. But ever since that update, I haven't been able to lockpick locks. It's really frustrating. I don't get it. Um, okay, some shotgun shells. That was pretty lame. Um, wood planks. Nails. Gotta have nails. That's always good. Can I? I don't think I can get over into there. Let's see if I can't hit it. So yeah, this is the like hold up spot. This is a dope spot. Don't get me wrong. This was a great place to go. I'm very glad we went here, guys. Very glad. Uh, two wood planks. I gotta put my other AKM away or something. Let's let's do this. Let's put the pistol compensator on there, and let's put the sight on there as well. Look at that. Uh, actually, I think I'm going to sell this AKM. Sell that, sell that. See? Can I put a battery in these? Where's my battery? There we go, battery. Can I put a... Okay, I can put my battery in there. And I think the reason why, guys, is because I had this mask, this respirator, and this um, NVG before the update. Which is a problem. Same thing with the flashlight. See, if I take these out... Uh, let me take these out off put these on these are the ones that don't work see this flashlight here let's put that flashlight on let's put the batter see yeah that that works so that means i gotta find a whole new mask which is actually not good for us yeah i'm gonna take the battery out of those put it in there look at just look at all this this is frustrating ah uh, that's not good guys that means i have to I've been finding NVGs left and right, so it's not a problem. But what is a problem is like finding another respirator at the moment. 
But I have NVGs right now and a battery. Yeah, I think it's over here. This is where I saw that building. Yeah, like, look at this. This looks to be like a stronghold of sorts. Huh. This almost looks like he's going to make it a traitor base. I think that's what this is going to be, guys. Because you can't get in there otherwise. And it looks pretty empty and devoid of life. So I guarantee you this is just going to be another traitor once they start updating the map and stuff. Cool. So that's fine. We can do that. We're going to head down to the safe zone and we're going to sell a lot of stuff. Get our money up. Hopefully they have a respirator there that I can buy now because mine is not going to work because it's from an old update. That's pretty trash, which means the one that I have as a secondary I have to get rid of as well. Yeah, let's go on ahead, guys, and I'll cut to it once we get there. Guys, I just realized something. That's the safe zone at that ship, and it's on the other side of the water. And this is that bridge. Um, it'd be really cool to make a base on this bridge, actually. But yeah, I gotta turn around. I gotta go all the way back. Uh, so it's gonna be enough. I'll cut back to when uh, we get there. <laughs> Might have to refuel on the way. Let's see. Alright, guys. We're on the road now to the trader. We're about to pull up here. I sure hope they're friendly. Crash ship safe zone. Nice. How's it going, friends? What's up? Diane Golden. How you doing? How you doing, guys? Oh, the barber? Ah. That's cool. We don't want to do anything with that yet. Nice, I got crafting stations. We got crafting stations. They have a a weapons trader. Nice. I can sell some of my weapons to him, and I think I might get more money then. Ooh, he's got a vector. I already have a few of those, so. Don't really need to do anything with that. Yeah, look at that. Sidearm is 200 now. 150 for that AKM. We're keeping that P90 for sure. We're gonna sell, sell these M9s, get rid of these M9 magazines. Thought I had more. I know I have more in the car. Oh, here we go. Winchester. Another Winchester. Nice. Oh, thank you. Who are you? The junk trader. Nice. So this is where we go to sell all of the junk that we find. Oh, guys, he has a radiation filter. Um, I'm actually going to buy that. I'm going to buy all three of them. Because I'll need that. Nine mil rounds, no. Uh, I'll buy a battery. I'll buy all four of those because I need it. Junk, yeah, so I got a lot of junk here. Uh, flashlight. Smartphone. Can opener. Binoculars. I'll just sell all this stuff. Cool, and who are you? The equipment. Nice. I wonder, oh, look at that, get a gas mask here, let's do that. Yes. Ooh, hiking backpack. What's the storage? So the storage is 5x8, this is 7x9, so. But yeah, I wanna, I'm gonna buy that. And the hazmat respirator is a lot better. But unfortunately... Nothing I could do with that. And hey, look, a tree. Nice. This is a really cool spot, guys. I'm really digging it. And it looks like there's possibly two more, uh, 
Two more traders here. Yeah, look at that. I can pet the dog. Nice. That's cool. Look at that. I'm going to go check the uh, car real quick and see what I can't grab out of there. Alright, so I'm just going to sell my old NVGs, my civilian ones, and this 9 mil here. Should be good. And now what I'm going to do is... I'm going to attach these filters I have. Guys, we are actually ready. We're ready for an FOB at this point. So I think what I'll do, guys, is I'm going to call the episode right here. I just want to thank you guys all so much for watching. In the next episode, we are going to do an FOB. I promise you that. Okay, but... Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. I know I did. We found some good loot. We found a good trader spot. And thank you guys so much for coming along on the journey. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. I want to respond to your guys' thoughts on this series. Please let me know. And uh, as always, I'll see you in the next one, gamers. Peace.